Good morning, everyone. We're back for another day. We are actually going to head down to the Dockside Food Court for breakfast. Pier 8 Market. The breakfast looks real good, so we're going to do that this morning. It's about 7.30, I believe. And today would technically have been our day that we were flying to come here. And we decided last minute to drive and said we felt it was safer. So we did drive and we had to leave on the weekend because dad is working on this vacation. So he had to leave on the weekend to drive. Line at Starbucks at this time. And the food court, still not a lot of people. I got the kids breakfast platter, which comes with eggs, biscuit, potatoes, a sausage link, and a piece of bacon, and a juice box which I didn't know, she told me as I was paying. And mom got the adult pancakes, comes with two, and then a, an order of, and a, a side of. order of hash brown. Did you like your breakfast? Yes, it was good. I have to drop down to the kids. Yeah, it was <laughs> two giant ones, she <laughs> ate half of two. Yeah, so. I told her to get it. I know her eyes are bigger than her appetite. Uh, yeah, so. Mine was real good. I got the kids meal, came with the eggs, bacon, sausage, biscuit, potatoes. I don't like those kind of eggs. Uh, when I make eggs at home, I have to like burn them, so these kind of eggs are not my jam, but it was still cheaper to get the kids meal. Uh, and it, like, I'm not a gigantic breakfast person. Uh, if I am hungry, I will grab like a granola bar, or I do will have like an egg, but it's usually at like 11 o'clock, so I'm not huge on breakfast to begin with. I really only eat it on the weekends or vacation. So it was the perfect size. And then it came with the apple, salt, apple juice and it was $6. So kids meals are the way to go. Like I don't eat this way at home. So when on vacation, like yes, I want to be able to eat an entire pie of pizza or 10 chicken fingers, but A, I can't and then I shouldn't. So saves my wallet and it's the perfect sign. Ooh, a little foggy, but it's 10.20 a.m. Bus is waiting, as always. Heading into the new Universal Studios store. We are trying to find bigger fanny packs. These are a little on the small side. We couldn't find the Remy and Figment ones, but they have them here at Universal. Definitely get yeah. The Grinch is cute. How much is it? $18. Ooh, $2 cheaper, too. Mom's on the search for a sweatshirt. $52. That's the best one though. Yeah. The others were only like long sleeves. And then I liked this hat. I was 100% gonna buy it. And then I looked at the price and it's $28. So, nope. And of course, Harry Potter has to always have his own gigantic section. It's a really nice store though. I'm gonna close it with your discount. 1726. Nice. Look at that little baby. How cute is he? <laughs> oh my goodness. Now we gotta find him to show him. Heading into studios again because we have to get our annual pass magnet. And I'm seeing a lot more of these safety advisories. Were they here the past couple days? Yeah. All around like this? I mean, I saw them, but I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I'm seeing them more. Just walking in. And the front is definitely more crowded than it was. Minions is a 50 minute wait. But once again, walking through Hollywood, it's not crowded. A lot of people don't come over this way because there are no rides in this one street. So if you want a nice quiet place to sit, this is your go-to. But we are heading in to the annual pass holder lounge, looking to see what uh, clothing items they have. I'm kind of looking for some specific fanny pack and hoping they have it in there and to get our magnet. We are sitting under in Mel's. Just people watching, doing our favorite thing. And it's, we literally walked in like five minutes ago and sat down and we're already hearing the same song that we, we walked in. So Universal has to make their loops longer because we like to just sit and people watch. Disney's loops are like an hour long, so you gotta at least get them up there. If they need help, Universal call me. I'm good at doing music. Here comes Dora and gang. I don't 
don't know where Dora's going. Usually she stops right here. Oh, going in the center. There they are. And now all the dancers are just chilling on the stage dancing. Here's the pass holder lounge. It is open from 11 to 4, so we were a little early, so just heading in now. Oh, the design. Helen is out for her show, but 11.30 make a park show. We're headed in. It's clearly not their idea to come here, was it? Let's go and get started. How old are you two? 12 and what? 12, 13? Nine? Good luck, buddy. All right, I can speak your language, kids. Hold on. So. No, no, no. Fortnite. Well, oh, I'm sorry. TikTok. TikTok. <laughs> I guess not, whatever. You know. Have they done this one at home yet? Oh. That's a hard one. I'm not good at this. Well, I'm not here, so leave my home, apparently. Oh, no. First time. Are you taking notes? Oh, dear, dear. Well, ladies and gentlemen. Yay. I'll put that away. We're not going to use that big rusty knife. This is a smaller, sharper knife. Right, come on over, Greg. Uh, if I can get your right arm over that tray, please. Perfect. Now, I'm going to so you slide up. Yep, I'm going to cut your arm. Is this technology still being used today? Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Today, we probably combine it with digital effects. Uh, CGI, that kind of Computer generated imagery. Very good. I have yeah. more Yeah. 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 machine all the way back here by E.T. But we're going on E.T. Certain things they're not doing the pre-show. This is just walk through. Don't even see your names anymore. Over here at the media center, they were looking for people. And you watch a TV show and they like, I've done it before. They, we watch a TV show, they like attach you to all these things and they like rate your heart. Like I watched a drama so they were like seeing if I like got excited while watching it. I heard them saying that it was a comedy, so that's a short show to watch. I had like the full hour. It's obviously, you're not watching commercials, so it wasn't the full hour, uh, but you get paid for it. I got like 80 bucks when I did it, but that was the longer one, so I don't know what they give for the shorter. We could just came back to see if we could do it, but heading on to City Walk for our lunch, we are going to go to Breadbox Sandwiches. Uh, Mama likes it there. I don't think I've ever had anything there. Uh, Gonna see if they have a salad. If not, I'll walk over to Moe's. I've done that. Mom got the BLTA, which is bacon, lettuce, tomato, and avocado, and the tots. I got the buffalo chicken sandwich with tots. I just get it without the blue cheese. My lunch was real good. I got the buffalo chicken sandwich. The chicken was super fresh. It was steaming when it came out. We had to wait a few extra minutes. Mom got hers first, and it was delicious chicken. I really liked it, something different. So far we've been trying all new things, had something different every day, but City Walk has great food. Very good, I like this. Even though she doesn't like that kind of salad that comes out. I'm not a fan of it, so. But, I think we took a little off. Yeah, you did pretty good. First time a bus is not waiting for us. It's about 5.15, this is people leaving. Heading into Islands for the first time this trip. Dr. Doom's fall are missing the things up top. They just took them away the other day. I wonder what they're doing. Spider-Man is down, Velocicoaster is down, Calm is down, and the park closes in an hour and a half. So, why is it down? Oh, flyers are down. So, we're kind of sitting right now. We gotta wait for Dad to get off of work. So, don't know where that was. Not much happening. <laughs> All right, Spider-Man went up, so we are running in. Hopefully, beat everyone trying to. They listed it as 15 minutes, but it literally just opened, so it's gonna be a walk-on. How was it? Amazing. Amazing. The amazing Spider-Man. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. 
Do you remember the first time we went on this? That like how amazed we were. Oh yeah. That, like <laughs> it's still I think one of the best rides. Like it was above its time. Like oh yeah. Definitely. When this came out, we were like, oh, that's that the amazing. best. And it's still like. I love it. I, I love this. Ride. We were gonna go on the trolley, but we just heard an announcement that's closed, so we're gonna go on one fish, two fish. So they even tell you exactly what number of fish to sit on. He has a little board and tells you where to go. All right, here we go. So I remembered on that ride you have to listen to the narrator to not get wet, but I forgot you have to know what color fish you are because it'll say like red fish, blue fish down, and we, we missed it. Got a little wet. We got wet. Did you get wet? No, I did Oh! Mom and I are going on Cat in the Hat. Candy store, mom got the dark chocolate with nuts apple. And I got the Simpsons donut. So tonight is a private event, which is why the park is closing at seven. And my dinner is Froyo. <laughs> Both parks close at seven, and it is seven. So we will see what the buses are like at park close. So this one bus, but this one was literally behind it, and then there's another one behind it. So, even at park close, no waiting. Stopped at the food court and mom got the chicken noodle soup. It was very good. Yeah. It's a good bowl and it's $4. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah. And just like that, another day has come to an end. We had a very relaxing day today. Today was technically supposed to be the day we arrived. Uh, we had a four o'clock flight. So we would just be like getting to the hotel if we kept that. But we did decide to drive, so we had to leave on the weekend, so we got some extra days. So we were very chill today. Did what we had to do, and yeah. Had some good food, had a good dessert, aka my dinner was Froyo, and then I just had a little piece of my Simpsons donut. So, very good, very good dinner for me, but it is about 8 o'clock. Both parks closed at 7 today because there was a private event. So we didn't, we went in not, we didn't even check. Silly on our part, but we only really got like an hour in the park. Uh, Kristen, Eugene, Bradley, and Dad went to eat uh, at the Mexican restaurant. They said it was okay. Um, but me and Mom ate a big breakfast at lunch, so we did not join them. But we have to make sure to make our Viva reg reservation soon because that's our favorite restaurant. So that'll be coming up soon, I'm sure. And not sure what tomorrow will bring. So with that, I say good night, everyone. <laughs>